In Austria, the last German armies in the southern redoubt had already been surrendered. Lieutenant General Brandenburger of the 19th German Army came down over the Brenner with his chiefs of staff to sign the capitulation in the small Austrian city of Innsbruck. American General E.H. Brooks has ratified another victory. But meantime, near the small town of Flensburg on the Danish border, Grand Admiral Dönitz, self-styled new Führer of Germany, winds up the last business of state. The surrender of his once great U-boat fleet. One by one, they enter British ports and are taken over by men of the Royal Navy. These Germans, once the terror of Allied shipping, are now, like all their comrades in arms, nothing but prisoners of war.